How's it going everybody? Abe with Auto Addicts here. Today we are on episode three of our SEMA build. We are about to leave our facility and go check out the Exorcist build and see its progress. So with that being said, let's go check it out. Okay guys, so we are in the car now in the shop Corvette C8 Stingray, uh, heading over to Perfect Color, our partnered body shop for the SEMA Exorcist build. And uh, let's go take a look at this. I am so excited. There has been so much progress on this car. Uh, the, the car is almost ready for paint, so it is time for a final inspection. Uh, for a final inspection on a project like this, we need as many eyes as we can get. When you build a custom car, uh, it is so important that you get extra set of eyes on the uh, bodywork and how the vision is supposed to play out. And the reason for that is when you are working on something consistently over and over, your eyes kind of get tired. So we want to help out our partners and make sure that everything is looking good and we're set for SEMA. So um, stay tuned, we're almost there. Alrighty guys, we are here to check out the SEMA build for this Exorcist Hennessy Camaro. Right behind me, you're gonna be able to see a sneak peek of the vehicle. Now, we have made tremendous progress on this car. It does not look the same in the last episode to now. It is a completely different vehicle. We have the fenders on, the front bumper on, the quarter panels on, the doors have been modified, and the rear end has something a little bit extra special on there that we can't show you guys in this video quite yet, but we will be announcing it at SEMA 2024. Now, come around this way. We can see now that this kit is now fully bonded. The fenders have been replaced. The front bumper has been modified and joined together with the original bumper to make a one piece silhouette style wide body build. My favorite part about this, if we come back here to the rear, is this quarter panel. Now, previously, this vehicle was intended to have a bolt-on kit as that's what this kit was designed for. We have gone above and beyond for our customer here and for SEMA to show you guys the possibilities of Auto Attic USA, of wide bodies, and what we can do to your vehicle. Over here, you will see we are truly bonded with the original quarter panel of this vehicle. And not only that, but the seamless transition between the quarter panel and the door into the rockers is near perfect. Now, the vehicle probably has about another coat of primer and block before we can get this thing into paint. Uh, the reason we're not ready to paint it yet is all these small details that a regular person won't really see, but we want to go above and beyond and we want to give this thing a flawless showroom finish. Uh, we haven't decided quite yet on the orange peel that we're going to have on the body kit. Now, if you don't know much about orange peel, you can have factory orange peel, which is what I would prefer, or we might go with the showroom flat finish so that when you look at it, it looks like a mirror. That's to be decided right before SEMA. Man, I am. I'm blown away. I'm speechless. This thing looks amazing, and we are so excited to get this project done and show it to you guys at SEMA 2024. So if you like what you see, if you're interested in seeing more, make sure you hit that notification bell, hit that like, hit that subscribe, so you can stay tuned for this reveal. Thank you so much for joining us today for episode three of the Hennessy Exorcist wide body conversion. Uh, man, words can't describe how happy I am. On the next episode, we're gonna be talking about what wheels that we're getting onto this, and how we're going to dial in the suspension just right and the full assembly. Uh, I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to capture that for you guys. I really hope that we can because it is a special moment when a car fully comes together and it is October, early October. SEMA is beginning in November, so it is crunch time. We are gonna be working seven days a week, 
probably 10 to 12 hour days to make sure this and the rest of the vehicles that we're bringing are going to be ready to show you guys in November. Thank you again for tuning in. We hope to see you soon. Until next time.